Access the toolbox by pressing and holding the black tools button on the drawing hand controller. An array of powerful tools will appear. To select a tool, move your drawing hand cursor over a tool, then release the button to equip. The default tool is Sketch, but we will cover these tools from left to right. At the far left, we have the Measure tool. To use the Measure tool, squeeze the drawing hand index trigger to place the first measure point. Then move your drawing hand controller in space to the next desired location, releasing the index finger trigger to set the second measure point. A unit readout is presented, and snap movement can be enabled by a simple squeeze of the non-drawing hand index trigger while creating a measurement. The next tool is Selection. The Selection tool allows for multiple objects to be carefully selected individually. Once you have selected the desired sketch geometries, access the Movement Gimbal by pressing the purple button on the non-drawing hand controller. The selected sketch objects will move according to how the gimbal is adjusted using the grab sphere on the drawing hand controller. Sketching tools are next and are covered in depth in a separate video. Following sketch, we have color and materials. This tool mode will provide you with a paintbrush to quickly modify the color and material of sketch geometries. Toggling to the right on the drawing hand controller transitions to a pipette tool, allowing color and material to be instantly picked up, then placed back by toggling to the paintbrush again. The purple button on the non-drawing hand presents your custom palette. These color and material presets can be named and their settings preserved across sessions, making regularly used combinations easily accessible. Use the drawing hand cursor to first select a slot, then select it again to open a color wheel panel that allows for color and material to be changed actively. Change the name of the preset by navigating to the name block at the top of the panel and selecting it. Enter the naming convention, then select the blue check mark at the top right of the keyboard. Viewpoints are the next tool to cover, and they are super easy to use. Place a viewpoint in the sketch by squeezing the index trigger on the drawing hand controller. Don't worry about initial placement of the viewpoint, because they can be grabbed and placed more specifically afterwards using the grab sphere. Viewpoints provide a dynamic moving function that occurs when two or more viewpoints are in a sketch. For both collab users in VR and screen collab joiners, these viewpoints become available within the viewpoints tab available to VR users by pressing the purple button on the non-drawing hand controller. Here, viewpoints can be reorganized, renamed, and even assigned to be the initial spawn point for collaborators entering the sketch. Teleport is a self-explanatory tool and is activated by pressing the index trigger on the drawing hand to first get a visual of where the teleport will transport. Releasing the index trigger will enable the movement and you will be relocated. This tool is most helpful when at 100% scale working inside large sketch rooms.